All right, so for, for those of you who have never seen Farmos before, I want to give you a quick overview. Usually when you start up the software, you will see this interface, which is um, yeah, made of four main areas. The top left is the so-called variables list, where all of the data that you load into Farmos uh, and work with inside of Farmos will be listed. In the lower left, there we have the functions library in this default view, where we have all the uh, functions that we can use to uh, manipulate our data or do something else. Uh, I will come to this in, in a few minutes. Uh, same as the lower right uh, area, which is the help section. Yeah, this is also very helpful when, when you start writing um, evaluation scripts, which we will talk about in a few minutes. And then we have the, um, the upper right area, which is basically the main um, area to work with in Farmers. So let me rearrange this here um, real quick and let's focus on this main area. Now, how do we get data inside of Farmers? There's an obvious way. Yeah? So in the main area, I see my data browser where I can scroll through the data of my hard drive. I can even create shortcut folders um, and sort them in a list. So I have a shortcut to the data that I want to use in this webinar. And now to import this data, uh, I can simply go ahead and double click and you can see it pops up in the variables list. I can also select multiple files and use right click and hit load and they will also be loaded. Last but not least, you can of course uh, use the old school method um, and go to the menu. So if I use the menu, hit load, then a dialog pops up where I can again browse through my computer hard drive and find my data that I want to load. And the reason why I'm bringing this up is I want to show you the list of supported, um, supported file formats in Pharmos that the software comes with by default. So this is a very long list of um, yeah, supported formats that we, we support in Pharma. So if you have a lot of different sources, um, you will most definitely be able to load your files all in Pharma. If a data format is missing that you are working with, please feel free to reach out and we can talk about an implementation. Okay, but for my presentation, I don't need this. So I will just hit cancel and we are back in the variables list.